What is up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of Dragon Speed Shop. Well, I know it's been quite a while since I did a little update or any kind of work on the Mustang. Um, I have been working on it, as you can kind of tell by, you know, the outside here. And it's a little dusty around my workbench lately. Um, I got a coat. I guess this is kind of more of an update of what's going on with the build. I got a coat of primer on there just so I can see all the imperfections of the bodywork and the mold and everything that we did on here. Um, it's not 100% done yet. Um, you guys can probably see here center screen. I still got a little bit of Bondo bodywork, body filler, whatever you guys want to call it. Um, but I've gotten these all worked. You can see the wheel wells are all nice and round um, now. The tires fit nice and beautiful in there. Same with the rears. Um, I spent Memorial Day sanding just this, um, surprisingly. It took me about six hours to get this where it's at. And then these parts here, we'll get to them in a second. Um, but a lot, a lot of work. I finally got the roof completely molded in up here. Um, bring that in a little closer. You can see I still got some work on these flares. They are being a nightmare to finish up. I've still got the work on the engine bay. Um, you can see it's still a little rough. But the body itself, it's pretty close to being done. Um, of what I've gotten left. So... Let's take a look here at the rear bumper. <clears throat> we get this slid in where it goes. A lot of trial and error fit and finish. Um, as you can see, it's a nice gap. I've got just a little bit more here, just across that center point. Um, but that turned out really, really nice. Let's see if we can get a little bit more light over here. There's light. There we go. So, pretty nice. If you guys are new to this build, um, what we have is a 64 and a half Mustang mixed with a 2013, the Roost 2013. This lower valence here um, part is the 2013 rear bumper, the rest is 64. Um, I've also molded the bumper right into that rear, rear pan there. Um, I've got a little bit to fix here, a little bit to fix on that side, just the fit issue. Um, rather than that, I'm really, really super happy with the way that bumper turned out. Um, front bumper, it is 100% done. So we'll get this fit in here. See if I can do this without looking. Without breaking it. Alright, there we go. Stay. <laughs> Been my day today. Temp number two. Alright, there we go. So there's the look at the front bumper. Um, as you guys can see, I've lowered the front bumper down. Um, usually it sits right flush with the bottom of the headlight buckets and stuff. And I've dropped that bumper down. Um, still got a little bit of tweaking just to get that bumper to fit perfect. But it, it's there. Um... On the bottom side, you can see I've molded the chin spoiler into that uh, radiator piece that we made um, that fits into the frame. So everything's getting kind of molded together. Really super clean build. Stuff like that. Um, the hood fitment I've still got to work on. <clears throat> but it's, it's getting there. It's really, really close. A um, little bit more work to get this seam to go away. Um, done a little bit of work to the frame, just kind of getting stuff cleaned up, getting gaps filled. So we're slowly getting there. Um, I'm hoping by next week I'll have this in some primer, and, or we're spraying primer. Um, Hopefully parts will be ready for that, but just kind of a short, sweet, little update video on what's going on with the Mustang. Um, 
I've had a couple of guys ask me what's going on in my live feeds that I do on Sundays, but it's getting there. Um, if you guys missed the last one, go back and check it out. Uh, we sprayed uh, Scale Finishes paint on uh, the boat. Um, turned out really, really nice. I'm really happy with it. Um, stuff like that. So, till next time, guys. This is Dragon Speed Shop. I'm signing out. Enjoy.